Okay, that race was a disaster. From delays to points confusion, sitting there for hours not knowing if the race was gonna be restarted or not. But by far the biggest mistake of this weekend happened when Pierre Gasly drove past a tractor that was on a live racetrack. After only three laps of racing, we had a red flag because Carlos Sainz went into the wall, there was debris everywhere, and the rain was just getting heavier. But before that red flag was shown, a tractor was sent out onto the track to collect Sainz's car, but every car still had to go past to catch up to the safety car before it was red flag. So Gasly, who was at the back of the pack, was still speeding up to catch the safety car queue when a tractor was going across the live racetrack. Gasly himself was obviously very shaken from this incident, and after Bianchi's incident only eight years ago at this very same track, it is certainly some very scary stuff. I mean, if they didn't learn from that incident eight years ago, and it's still happening to to this day, are they ever gonna learn? They keep saying driver safety is the most important thing and the thing they care about most. And it's the reason, you know, we have these two hour long delays, waiting for the rain to stop so drivers can go out on track all because of their safety. But a tractor out on a live racetrack is much more dangerous than any amount of rain. Multiple drivers were obviously very upset about this. Apparently Sebastian Vettel brought this up at a driver's meeting earlier that week, and yet we're still seeing it during the race. The FIA have got a lot of explaining to and they've already released a statement basically putting the blame on Pierre Gasly. And the Sky commentary did the same thing. They were trying to blame Gasly for this incident, saying he was going too fast under double-waved yellows and red flag conditions. The red flag was shown seconds before Gasly reached that tractor. And it wasn't only Gasly. All the other cars passed the tractor that was on the track and multiple drivers coming out clearly upset with the tractor on track. So this is obviously very shocking to see and I hope we never see anything like this ever again. But if I'm honest, the FIA being the FIA, I wouldn't be surprised if they learn absolutely nothing from this. And the whole points confusion, no one knew whether they were getting half points, quarter points, full points. It ended up being full points in the end. No one really knows what the rules are in terms of that because they all changed at the start of this year because of Spa last year. But in the end, full points were awarded and Max Verstappen became a two-time world champion. So congratulations to him. He's been absolutely brilliant all season, but hopefully we never see anything like the incident we saw today ever again.